Hello, today we are going to see how to install Maven for Eclipse so that we will be able to launch Maven builds from Eclipse. It seems that recent versions of Eclipse starting from Luna contains built-in support for Maven. So that means there is no need for us to separately install a Maven plugin for Eclipse. First of all, we need to download Eclipse. Let's go to the download URL. It's eclipse.org slash downloads and download the latest Neon version. Hit the download button and save the Eclipse installer file. Let's go to the folder in which Eclipse installer is saved and check if it contains any virus. Let me run the antivirus software here. Okay, no threats found. I'm closing it. Let's double click the Eclipse installer. Eclipse installer brings up five different flavors of Eclipse IDE out of which only the top two is meant for Java developers. The first version for Java developers only supports graphical user interface development and it doesn't provide any support for database development. Whereas this uh, second version, the version for uh, Enterprise Edition, it provides full-fledged support for developing an enterprise Java web-based application. So let's go ahead and choose this one. This is the installation folder where you would like to install Eclipse. And these two entries, create start menu entry, create desktop shortcut are already pre-checked. Let's go ahead and install. The installation successfully completed and we are going to launch Eclipse. When Eclipse IDE launches, it asks for something called a workspace. In Eclipse, workspace is a folder where it stores all its internal settings and preferences. And also all the Eclipse plugins store their preferences in this folder. And one thing to keep in mind is, if you already have an Eclipse version installed in your system, then you need to provide a different directory for this version because each installed version of Eclipse requires its own workspace directory. In my case, I already have an older version installed, so I am going to provide a new directory here. For you, if this is the first time you are installing Eclipse in your system, you can leave the workspace folder as it is. If not, please go ahead and change this to a new directory. Every time you launch Eclipse, it will ask for this workspace folder. If you do not want Eclipse to bug you, each time you launch Eclipse, you can simply check this box and hit OK. Okay, so we have successfully installed and launched Eclipse and are able to see the welcome screen. Let's close it. Go to the file menu, select new. Under new, we are able to see various Java projects. We are interested in the Maven project and let's click Maven project. It brings up a new Maven project wizard. That means we have successfully installed Eclipse that has built-in support to build Java projects with Maven. For more video tutorials and blogs on Hadoop and Big Data, please visit us at our website, bitequest.net. Thank you.